Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with another note about the ET4X firmware. So, my friends, let's get cracking. All right, so messing with firmware is always dangerous, and I mentioned that in the video and how I try to tend to not mess with it. Uh, you'll notice up here I typed ET4X firmware. I went to the ET's newest firmware. I showed you this earlier. Uh, when we get here, this is not for the ET4X. So I want to make sure I get out here now. This is not the right firmware. So since I was on the ANAP page, I went to the forums. And in the forums, if you go down to the ET series, there's a lot of information about them. Uh, but instead, I backed up. And the place to really look is down here in firmware. And when you get to it, they've got ET4 firmware updating guides. They've got the newest one that we were looking at. This is the exact same info that I showed you on that other page. It was just turned into a blog. And the biggest thing I want to say is back here on the firmware tab, ANET, if you want to make this so that people understand what the heck you're talking about, have one of these for the ET4, have another one for the ET4X, and have another one for the ET4 Pro just simply put separate posts in your forums and you won't have all the issues of people trying to force the wrong firmware on the wrong device uh, it's such a simple solution i just figured i'd share maybe if we give enough thumbs up to this video uh anet will actually see it and we can get it solved once again friends i do not recommend flashing firmware it is not a magic solution for a 3d printer uh, learning how to use your 3d printer uh, they all have little quirks i think the more time you spend working with them on simple projects the more likely you're gonna get your printer to do what you want Alrighty, friends so if you found it useful please give it a like if you've got a question comment or suggestion add it down below if you haven't subscribed yet what are you waiting for smash that subscribe button and last but not least hit the notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me hl mod tech thanks for watching have a great day